Hello everybody. I'm gonna try to blaze through this video. There's a lot to show. Um, some, this is kind of like my national. This is, I didn't go to the national. But this is some new pickups, as you see, and some birthday gifts. My birthday was uh, a month ago. Um, flippy. Uh, I would also like to say that I'm kind of been criminally negligent on thanking people uh, for their gifts and um, responding to, to comments. I just feel like I've been, I don't know why I've had less energy to give recently, but um, I'm working on that. So thanks for being patient with me. Um, starting things off, this is just a magazine that I got, going quick. Here we go, this is from... Uh, Andrew from Page and Dini Bean. Uh, I hope you enjoy this card and have a happy birthday, Doug. Hello, Doug. Oh, I said this in the in the wrong order, but I read this a while ago. Hello, Doug. Hey, Dougie K. Bonjour, Pierre. Happy birthday. I only sent one card, not to confuse the situation. So, awesome card, man. Love it. And then, let's see what we got here. So, this is insane. This is uh, a 1969 Life magazine, September. So amazing, ma amazing, thoughtful gift, along with David Wright, Tom Seaver, and a great birthday card. Look, this is just awesome. And it's from my good friend, there's more, there's more. Happy birthday, Doug. Hope you had a great day and that it was filled with love, joy, and cards. That's just your friend Dave, Legends of the Dugout. So check those fellas out. Got some new pickups. Uh, Addy Joss, 1.5. Yeah, this is, uh, we'll take that all day long, right? But the, the eye appeal is so nice. This is a gift to, that I'm showing. A gift from my sister. So if she sees this, she'll know she's getting me a gift. This is a gift that I got for my birthday from my wife. So that's awesome. Here's a card that I got some months ago and never showed. Love this card. It's really, really nice eye appeal. I mean, it has touched corners there. This is my, um, I would say my favorite Sandy Koufax card in visually. Um, and I know that everyone has their own. So, uh, Johnny Mize, what's remarkable about this is it was under 50 bucks. Uh, so, you know, whenever you can do that, you'll do that. Um, and this card, you know, I just got it because I, couldn't think of anything else and it's not because it's you know it's remarkably beautiful i think um adam from uh vintage sanctuary called it lemon like a lemon lemon cherry awesomeness or something like that which is i think that's what it is i i really 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 love this card really love it i've always loved it but i've never had it now i can love it and have it at the same time which is really what you how you want to do it um this is a heiny minouche um, his friends called him buttocks. <laughs> okay. Um, this, the, the crazy thing about this is, um, it has a mark on it and I can, I couldn't see the mark until I pulled out this guy. There we go. See that mark? There's a little mark there. I mean, there's, there's some, there's like little speckle marks, but I've looked on the back of a lot of these and they, they, they tend to have these little print marks. Um, there is absolutely nothing that can be seen um, as a mark that's obvious to my to my eyes that aren't that great. So that was interesting. I've been on an, uh, a Queen Elizabeth slash Princess Elizabeth rookie kick. I started with this card and uh, I didn't stop. This is uh, Diamond Stars card. I say more about this guy, but not right now. Uh, except this is, you know, awesome. An amazing looking card. Just in great shape. 
And this card I've been wanting to get for a while, Al Lopez. But yeah, love it. Okay. And now, just, we're just rushing through this, you know? They did these in two sections. They gave me some rubber bands that I can reuse. Like I mentioned, Queen Elizabeth kick. Queen Elizabeth kick. This is also a rookie. This is a rookie year. I think she was center field. Uh, uh, but that's before she was an infielder. And uh, this is um, Majestic. This is a card that I wa really wasn't sure about. Um, I think it's really pretty nice detail up close. But the but the edges are, you know, not the prettiest. So um, 2.5, definitely happy with that. Old Albie. Old Albie. Now I have a 2.5 Albert Einstein that um, I'd say it looks better than this card. So I feel like I got um, a, little, a bit generous grader here. But here we go. This card is sweet. Am I right? Am I right? I got to take this this off here. This has been a card that I've, been, I've wanted as soon as I got back kind of into pre-war. Um, and I was patient on getting a nice one at auction. Uh, so that's just such, such an epic card, I think. Cool. All right, so now my couple biggies. All right. So we have here, this is an embossed postcard card from 1906. And this has been identified as being Frank Chance, which is really cool. And um, this probably would have graded higher hadn't it had this little $5, at some point this was $5 in pencil. Um, I was thinking of erasing it. I was actually gonna erase it, but I didn't. It got a three. I don't really care. Um, but, um, I don't, I, I also don't know if it's risky to do something like erase something. Um, if it leaves like any residue or something like that, 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 you know, seems like an alteration. Uh, now this I got from Scott Reindeer Studios. This is... I would say you know, one of the one of my favorite gifts I've, I think I've ever gotten in any way, shape, or form. Um, let's look at this guy. It's a little gruff little guy here, right? Can we see him? Yeah. So, uh, Scott, you continue to amaze me with your generosity and, and your insight on me. Um, this is just the coolest. All right, everyone. Thanks. This has been my national and um, I hope you're doing well.